Death, like birth, is a secret of nature. Marcus Aurelius Antoninus, second century AD. In the days after a massive asteroid smashed into our planet, a plague of fire has scorched the land. Death is everywhere. The lucky few to survive see nothing but misery around them. They may have envied the dead. But this is what our ancestors, the mammals, have to survive if they are to inherit the Earth. It's still only three days after impact. You're witnessing the beginning of a new lethal plague, one that will brutally kill even more dinosaurs throughout the globe. Weather systems are being altered dramatically by smoke, soot, ash, and a huge influx of toxic chemicals. The most potent is sulfur, produced by the type of rocks vaporized during impact. When the asteroid hit in the Yucatan, it landed in a bed of gypsum, a mineral that contains sulfur. Millions of tons of this caustic element would have been blasted into the atmosphere in just a few short hours. If you scoop up the sedimentary, sulfur-rich stuff, it goes up in fine particulate material. The sulfur comes in contact with water in the atmosphere, and it converts, after several chemical reactions, to an acid, sulfuric acid. The skies are poisoned. Water once brought life to the world. Now it brings only pain and death. Corrosive enough to dissolve rock, this lethal rain would burn flesh on contact. With nowhere to hide, the big dinosaurs suffer intensely. In what is now Western China, a large meat eater can't find shelter from the storm. This is Tarbosaurus, a close relative of the T-Rex. Tarbosaurus is just under 40 feet long, a little smaller than T. rex. 60 banana-sized teeth line its powerful jaw. In the days before the disaster, Tarbosaurus stalked these wide river valleys and plains with impunity. Not anymore. The acid rain comes down in sheets, torturing the dying beast. Within days, the lethal monsoons will drive this animal into extinction. The animals that Tarbosaurus once preyed on should be flourishing with them gone, but they aren't. Their prey, the Titanosaurs, are a type of long-necked sauropod and the last in a long lineage of dinosaurs stretching back 150 million years.